really quick update. Neck's been reset on the Harmony. Um, we did a neck reset on it. Uh, we just got to hammer a fret back in it, glue a fret back in it, and we just got to clean up some glue that got on it. When the glue's dry, we'll clean all that up with some warm water and some special chemical to get that out. Um, a little bit of the finish came off on the side, but the neck is tight. And this isn't a restoration. This is just to get it to be more playable than it was when I first got it. So we did a neck reset on it. And we did a bridge reglue. Um, we put new two new dowels in it. Uh, the neck wouldn't fit, so we had to cut one dowel out. So instead of having three, it has two new dowels in it. Um, I put the tight bond glue on, so hopefully um, when it's time to restring it, uh, the neck doesn't fall off of it. It shouldn't. Uh, tight bond's a pretty good glue. It's a really strong glue. Uh, part of the problem with the guitar is the glue they used was not good glue. The tight bond's really good glue, so that neck should hold. The neck's a lot straighter than it was when I first got it. You can tell the difference in the way the neck is on it. There's a little bit of a gap, but it was like that when I got it, but it's a lot tighter, so the action should be uh, even lower than it was. Of course, the action wasn't that bad on it when I got it, but, you know, Harmony necks have a habit of coming loose with age on all Harmony guitars that I've dealt with over the years, so we took it off, we put two new dowels in and we re-glued it. We got a clamp right there holding the fingerboard on and we have a, a longer clamp uh, gluing the heel back on. Um, we got a little bit of an epoxy on there from when we uh, put the two new dowels in because I wanted something that would dry faster so I could just do the neck reset right away. So, uh, But the neck is straight on it, uh, pretty straight compared to before. Uh, we also did a bridge re-glue. So, uh, yep, neck reset, bridge re-glue. Uh, we might touch it up. I don't know. We might just clean the old glue off and call it a day. I don't know. Um, we have saddles for it. We have a bunch of saddles that will probably fit it. We got bone, plastic, plastic, and plastic, and one bone saddle. So, you know, I'll have to have my father restring it up, and we'll see how it does. But uh, we got to let the glue dry, and then we'll take the clamps off the neck. And uh, we'll get some warm water, try to get as much of the old, the glue off. Uh, I got a little of the epoxy stuff from the dowels on it. So there's this, there's some chemicals. I'm going to see what they got at the hardware store so we can get that crap off of it. So you, maybe we'll touch it up with some shellac or something. We'll see. But I more likely just want to get it playable. Um, bridge is tight. We re-glued it. We put brand new Phillips head screws in the bridge. Bridge is really tight, so that should help the action be low, as long with the tight neck joint. Um, this guitar over here has been under pressure for almost a month now. Well, well, we've been fooling with the harmony, so uh, we're going to be taking the clamps off of that and cleaning uh, any dried out glue on that. And uh, hopefully the uh, action on that guitar is uh, a lot lower than it was. And the clamps have been on it for a while, so... And hopefully it flattened it somewhat to get the string action down. The uh, the board was loose. We re-glued it with tight bonds. So uh, the only thing that one really needs now is machine heads. But uh, we won't know anything about the action until we uh, throw a set of strings on it. Uh, they're both nylon string style guitars. So we got to get a set of strings for both these guitars and a set of machine heads. But there you go. The harmony is done. The neck is glued on. The bridge has been re-glued, new screws put in place. So the harmony is getting better every second. Uh, we add our paper towel up here to get any squeeze out. That's how you get it out, moist paper towel, slightly moist. You know, try to get as much squeeze out as possible when you do pairs on the guitar. So there you go, there's the finished product. But we just got to clean old glue off of both of them. There you go, folks. The harmony is done and almost set for restring. So is the other one.